Hi everyone and um, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Just wanted to do a very quick update, um, just to let you know that my latest course is now out and available on Pluralsight, which is quite exciting. Uh, so this course is a little bit different to what I normally work on. It's called a play-by-play -play course. And this course is on developing engaging digital realities. So it's about virtual reality, mixed reality, and augmented reality. And I've worked on this course with my good friend and Pluralsight colleague, Lars Clint. Now, play-by-play -play courses are a little bit different to normal Pluralsight courses. So a more traditional course will be the author narrating over um, a presented set of slide decks, as well as doing technical demos, like you know, live coding demos and such. But a play-by-play -play course is a bit different. And the way this works is you have two people sitting behind a desk and you are filmed by a professional film crew. So you have lots of cameras set up all around you, mics, lights, and all, and all that sort of stuff. And with a play-by-play -play course, they're completely unscripted, so we don't write a script out beforehand. We literally just have a series of bullet points of things we want to cover. And these courses are designed to be about an hour long, and they focus on a very specific niche, and or a niche sort of topic. And that topic is done as a discussion. So you have one person who is the subject matter expert, and you have the other person who's kind of the, the questioner and the person driving the conversation forward. So in this course, uh, Lars was the subject matter expert, so he spends a lot of time going around the world, talking at conferences and doing Pluralsight courses on mixed reality, specifically the Microsoft HoloLens platform, and how to develop software in that using Unity 3D. So this course takes kind of a more of a, a broader look at the subjects of virtual reality, mixed reality and augmented reality, in which we do talk quite a bit about the HoloLens. And my role in this course is to be kind of the the casual observer. So I'm kind of asking the questions which the audience are probably asking themselves at the time when watching the course. So I sort of help um, sort of drive Lars forward in getting him to explain different things. I ask kind of devil's advocate questions. So it comes as kind of like a one-on-one -on -one interaction between the two of us. So these courses are absolutely brilliant fun to record. This is my second published one. I did one back in January when I was at NDC London. And we did that on enterprise data security in Microsoft Azure. So that was all about encryption key management. And in that course, I was a subject matter expert and Lars was the person helping to drive the conversation forward. So that came out in March and this one has now just been released uh, today. And I've got two more which I've recorded with Lars as well. So they should hopefully be out by the end of the year. So we've got one on social engineering and manipulation, which was really good fun to record. And we've got another one on um, Swift programming uh, on the Apple Mac. So that's also quite exciting. So those should hopefully be out by the end of the year. Um, so that's all I want to do. It's just a quick update, just to let you know that that course is out. So if you are a Pluralsight subscriber, then it's available to you for to go and watch now. So please do and let us know what you think. Um, if you're not a Pluralsight subscriber and you are keen to you know check it out and look at some of the courses on there, then you can either sign up via the site, and I believe they've got a short... Um, trial which you can do or if you get in touch with me so go to my blog at stephenhaunts.com and get in touch with me via the contact form I can also give you a 30-day trial code uh, which lets you experience the whole library you know completely unrestricted unrestricted for 30 days and then you know if you like it which I'm pretty sure you will you can then go and sign up uh, and become a full member so lots of brilliant courses on there around software development personal improvement creative and digital courses you name it, there's most likely a course on it on plural sites. It really is a good a good value proposition for keeping your skills up to date. So that's it. Thank you very much. Um, if you like this video, please hit the subscribe button and the little bell notification next to it. And that will mean that you're notified whenever I release new videos. So thanks a lot and speak to you soon.